Yo, what up guys, um, Frazzled HD here. I'm going to give you guys a tutorial on how to make a photo to line drawing on in Photoshop. Um, so yeah, let's get started. So basically this is the look that you're going to get after uh, doing the line drawing. Mm, so ba it basically just uh, takes the color and makes it look like it's pencil drawn. Okay, so yeah, let's go. Oh, yeah. oh my bad. Okay, so just find the uh, picture, maybe on the internet, or maybe if you want to do a picture of someone in your family or so, just open it up in Photoshop. I'm doing Daisy Fuentes. Just open up Daisy. And so, this is the picture that I'm going to be using. And so, yeah, some of the settings might be different for you guys. It just depends on the resolution of the photo. But if you follow the tutorial, you should get the the look that you're supposed to get. Okay, so if you get off the internet, it's going to be a lock layer. So what you want to go to do is duplicate the layer. And just just make sure your uh, your background copy is highlighted, not the more original background. So once you have that highlighted, go up here on layers, and from normal, click to uh, uh, color dodge. So it does that. And um, now you want to want to click Control I. So it basically inverts the photo. It's still there. It's just inverted so it's all white and now go up to filter blur and we're gonna go to Gaussian blur so now this is where it depends on your own settings just depending on what um, what resolution the photo that you got is I like to keep it at 2.2 .2, that's where it looks the best but if you're going for like well that's completely inverted going for like a really light look, go downscale, and if you go back up here, hold up, yeah, it basically does it, it gives it like a light effect, but 2.2 .2 usually works for most photos, so just keep it at 2.2 .2 and click OK, and now basically, it's, everything's done, you just gotta make it black and white, so go down here to your, uh, to your fill adjustment, and click on it, go to hue and saturation. And on the saturation, make the meter thing all the way at uh, negative 100. So all the way down. And just, yeah, there you go. That's uh, just the pencil look. And from there on, you can just edit, maybe put some text or so, whatever you want. I don't even know how to spell her name. Um, so yeah. Yeah, so basically you can just edit anything you want from there, and you're done. So, peace you guys.